My name is uh, Joey Jolene Siosaya, Winston Churchill, my darling. When we, I was still a baby, every weekend we'll be going to the palace. When we go and spend the weekend there, the queen said, what's his name? When my grandmother said, Joe, then the queen said, no, change it to Joey. So that's how I really got my name, was from Her Majesty. One memory my mother has of when Joey was a toddler, he had very, very feminine features and really, really curly hair. So my, my mother had a life-size doll as well. And she said, oh, you're prettier than my doll. So she put the dress of her life-size doll on Joey and put his hair in ringlets and then to take him around. And it was completely, you know, it, 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 it wasn't to mock him or anything. She just loved it. Since then, he's always been that special and close to her. My father, he never liked me wearing dresses. And I remember very well, I was the first one to wear a, a dress, an actual dress in public during the day. I mean, the, the girls always wore dresses, some of the drag queens, they were, but it was only, only at night. You only see them wearing that at night. But with me, I said, what's the use of wearing it at night when you're not even, you know, so I started wearing it during the day. And when my father sees me, because he was a member of parliament, when he saw me in public with dresses, he didn't like it. You know, you're putting me to shame. There were times that I feel I, I'm not worth it. Um, it's like I don't have a sense of belonging. You know, it got to the point that I almost took my life away, you know. I just stayed away from everybody. And uh, I prayed. I think I must have said almost 200 rosaries. <laughs> and, you know, that as in God, what is my purpose in life? Why was I made like this? Why can't I be the person that everybody wants me to be? When I finally put myself together, I said to myself, my life was given by someone else, and I have a purpose in life, you know. And um, I think it made me a stronger person. And then I decided to come and face the world with it. And I promised to myself that I will, I will be somebody. and I will never bend my life to anyone's policy, you know. And I need to do something for my kind of people, you know, for my own community. <laughs>